everybody, it's Brandon again. Before we get started here, I want you to just appreciate the convoluted setup I got going on for my recording. I'm streaming Chrome OS, that's on this laptop, using Chrome Remote Desktop onto this other computer running Chrome OS. It's because I tried to record this video on the laptop first and it just couldn't handle the recording. But uh, this laptop's where I have the dev channel with the feature I want to show you, so I'm doing it this way. Anyway, don't worry about it. We're going to make it work. So what I want to show you today is a new app mall that's coming to the uh, Chrome OS and Chrome OS Flex on version 126, which I have running on the dev channel uh, that you can see up on the little window here. And so we're on dev channel, we got Chrome OS 126. And the first thing you got to do if you want to try this is go into flags. And you got to search for mall and enable Chrome OS app mall. Really easy to do. You'll do that. It'll go ahead and restart. And once you restart, you're going to find yourself with this icon that I got in the corner that's got these dots on it, get apps and games. If it's not on your little taskbar, it'll be in the uh, whatever they call a start menu. So you click on that, <clears throat> and we got this new app mall. And as you see on the left, you got search, home, apps, games, and a link to the Play Store, which on a Chrome OS Flex device like this, there's no Play Store. It brings you to the Google Play Store website, which is useless, but that's neat. So let's close out of that and look at the app mall. If you go home, it just has some featured apps and things like that, featured games. Then you have a sideboard bar category for apps and one for games. It looks like there's no categories in games, but on apps you do have a few categories. Communication, creativity, entertainment, other, and productivity. And let's look at games. You got, uh, I saw Stardew Valley up in the front. But one thing you'll notice is almost all of these are just links to the Google Play Store. So for instance, Stardew Valley, install from the Play Store. You can click on Get App. And again, it just takes you to the Play Store website which will allow it, you to install it onto uh, your phone if you want to. Uh, you won't be able to install it on Chrome OS Flex, but if you're using an actual Chromebook, I assume this will just work. So let's close out of that and go back into our app mall. You'll notice some of the, uh, probably not so much in games, but if you go to apps, some of them won't just say install for Play Store. They'll have something like Pinterest here, two options available, and you'll click on this. And you can either install from Play Store, which they recommend, or from the web, which I would recommend even on a real Chromebook. Um, Android apps are always a pain on a Chromebook. That's my opinion. You may think differently. So if you go to install from web, you get this little pop-up. I don't really want to install Pinterest on here, so I'm not going to do it. Oh, I accidentally clicked it. Ah. Okay, so we got Pinterest now. <laughs> Let's open that up and eventually the PWA will come up for Pinterest, which I will uninstall later. Okay, so that's the app mall. Uh, not overly useful, in my opinion, because it seems like it's basically just things for the Play Store. And I saw one or two web apps on here that were not available on the Play Store. Like here's one called Photopea. I've never really heard of that. Let's check it out. But as a developer, I don't see anywhere where you can actually submit your own PWAs to this thing. So I think it's a, a uh, what do they call it? Anyway, it's a cur yeah, curated list from Google themselves. Which means there's not going to be all that much on there. Maybe eventually you'll be able to have other people submit apps to this and it'll have a bigger catalog. But right now it's going to be mostly uh, just stuff from the Play Store, which if you can actually use a Play Store, you're actually going to have the real Play Store app on your Chromebook, which makes more sense. Um, but yeah, there it is. What do you guys think? App Mall coming in Chrome OS 126. So look forward to that. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching, and I hope you all have a good day. Bye now.